it's important to remember and, and to know that diabetes usually, type 2 diabetes usually doesn't work alone. It's a very good pal. It likes friendships. And so once diabetes finds a good medium, guess what? It causes hypertension. I mean, I'm sure Dr. Safu has friends. Lexus, you have friends. I'm sure Friday night, if I call a friend of yours, he knows exactly where you are. <laughs> That's exactly the thing about diabetes and hypertension. They like being together. Right. So if your blood sugar is high, know that if hypertension hasn't arrived, then probably in traffic, it is coming. <laughs> <laughs> they go together. Cholesterol. They love their, each other's company. The fact is, the medium that hyper diabetes thrives in is the same medium that hypertension loves. If you have a friend, you like a certain kind of music, you are likely to be in the same place. You like going to church, we'll be in church. If you like going to one club, <laughs> you are likely to be there. And that's what happens. One arrives and it calls the others. So once you've been diagnosed with one of these, be very careful. The others are on their way. And that is why I was happy to be part of this program because it won't be enough to talk about hypertension and cholesterol without talking about the others. Mm -hmm. Now, it's not just that. Obesity or being overweight, that is also another good power. They all love to be in the same body that is overweight. And so we must talk about these things. Obesity is not just a storage of fat. In the past, we used to think, oh, the person is storing fat, so what? Fat is actually an organ that produces chemicals that are also toxic to the vessels. What we call in science, we say cytokines and all those things. So all, the, all these inflammatory cytokines and inflammatory markers are dangerous to the cardiovascular system. So being overweight or being, you know, having a, a lot of adipose fat, fatty tissue is not just an inert thing. Granted, you can have people who do not have fat tissue but still have um, these things but generally if you have you know excessive fats then you are likely to have these toxic components in your body